And now for a simple monkey, taking a 260 and inflated it, leaving about a four inch tail. You make a little bubble about an inch and a half. And you're gonna make a little small half inch bubble. Make that into a pinch twist. This will be his nose. And now we're gonna make about a one and a quarter inch bubble, just slightly smaller than that one. Now we're gonna make three more bubbles. About an inch and a half bubble. A slightly smaller bubble, just over an inch. And then another bubble, the same size as this one here. So you should have a series of your long bubble, a pinch twist, a smaller bubble, and then these three here are going to make his head. These are the two cheeks and the head, so we'll take and just twist all of that together. And then take the nozzle, poke it back to that three bubble set we've created there. Come around to the back and grab the knot, and then twist it around the base of the head a time or two, and tuck it up inside to hide it out of the way, and then you may have to push it back in. There's our monkey's head. Now for a body we're going to make, he's going to be sitting down with his hands on his knees, or on his feet. So make about an inch and a half bubble, another inch and a half bubble, a third, and then finally a fourth. We'll make four little bubbles. And then twist that around the base of his head what's left over. So you end up with a diamond, and then this is left over. Now with what's left over, you're going to twist off you want to kind of pull it so it sits like that, so measure to where your these are making sort of an L, in this case about a two inch bubble. Now you want to go with that to the bottom of this diamond that we have here, this bottom point. Go around and then tuck the tail back up through, securing it in place. And then you can shape his tail by throwing it up and giving a little squeeze. And you've got a quick and simple little monkey.